Aloha everybody, Mr. Pike here. In this video, I'm going to show you the very basics of getting your Chromebook set up and ready for online learning. When you take your Chromebook home, set it up in a nice, quiet learning area, a place where you can focus. Remember to keep open water bottles and food away from your computer. We want to make sure we treat all our technology with respect. When you first get your computer, carefully open the lid. After a few seconds, it should begin to start. You'll see a white screen that says Chrome at first, and then you'll get to the startup page. If your computer doesn't start right away, press the power button in the top right of your keyboard. If your computer still doesn't start up, you might not have battery power and you'll need to plug it in. You should see your startup page with your name on it. Your teacher should have also given you the password to get into your computer. Now this will only work for your computer, so keep it in a safe place, and if you can, memorize it. Use your keyboard to type in the password. Remember to keep an eye out for any capital letters. Then press the enter button. Wait a couple of seconds and your computer should log you in. Before you get started, you'll need to connect your Chromebook to your home's wireless internet or Wi-Fi. You might need an adult to help you with these steps. It can get a little tricky. Here's how you do it. Use your mouse to click on the bottom right corner of your screen where you see the time. A menu should come up. On the top left of the menu, you'll see what looks like a slice of pizza that should say no networks. Click on it and your computer will start looking for Wi-Fi networks. You'll need to click on the name of your home network. On the window that opens up, type in your Wi-Fi password and hit connect. Now you're on the internet. Here's a few more tips to help you get started. Press the large speaker to make the volume louder on your computer, the small speaker to make it softer, or the speaker with a line through it to mute it. If you press the large sun on your computer, you can make your screen brighter. And if you press the small sun, you can make it dimmer. This could help you see better as you're working. You may also want to plug in some headphones. They'll help you hear better and keep out distractions. Just don't turn the volume too high. And that's the basics for getting started with your Chromebook. I'll be back with more hints and tips for online learning. See you later.